Travel, budget, cars. Welcome to the life of PK. Bueno! Here, I don't know where it goes. You wanna go explore? Go. Let's do it. Ah. Good day, guys. All the wonderful visitors watching us and expecting a nice video from San Agustin, Florida. Um, we're headed out for breakfast. It's really chilly, actually. It's about in the 40s. But we're headed out to breakfast to see what we can find. Uh, we found a place online. It's called Maple Street. Uh, we're gonna go there and see what we can explore. There's cake. It Hello. looks cute as always. Uh, yeah, let's see what trouble we can get into. And then we're gonna go to the little castle that I wanted to go to today, or yesterday, I mean, but I couldn't make it. Uh, so let's get it on. Uh, it's, uh, it's chilly, as I said. But it's very sunny and it's nice. We're we're well prepared and well dressed. So I'll catch you guys when we get to the Maple Street. I think that's what it was called, right? Uh, Maple Biscuit, I think. Maple Biscuit Street. Something. We'll clarify. We'll when clarify we get there. when we get there. Bye. <laughs> Maple Street. We're hungry. We made it. We found it. So we made it here to Maple Street. It's busy. I don't know if you guys can see behind us. They it's just sent people like it's, it's to make the line all the way Yeah, it's, it's, it's pretty busy. I think you guys hear probably by the noise too. It's like very loud. So we ordered some uh, plain waffles and some biscuits and gravy, or no, biscuits and eggs. Biscuits with eggs and, and bacon some, for you. And bacon for me and some orange juice. So Fresh I'll show you. Fresh orange juice, yes. this is really nice. I'll show you that, guys, when, uh, when it gets here. Oh, wait, tell them about, tell them about what they asked us at the end of our orders. Oh, they also ask you, like, when you put in your order, like, what country you want to go visit. And silly me, I was thinking what's coming up next. Spoiler alert, England. Uh, but she was thinking of Switzerland, that's her dream place we wanted to visit together so far. So we'll see, hopefully it happens. So here's the famous breakfast. We got basic, because we're basic, <laughs> we got basic biscuits and eggs with some uh, jam on the side, bacon and some waffles and some orange juice. That's it. And now we're going to dig in and eat. Well guys, we barely we barely made it. Kay's freezing. freezing. She's getting I think she's getting sick too. Yeah. Uh, but now we're gonna make our way to the castle. So we're gonna go through St. George. St. George? Place Street. And then, and then right straight across. to the castle. Right across. So one thing I wanna say about St. Augustine is it's very, very little. It's tiny. It's so, a small town. Yeah, our our Airbnb um, was probably like a five minute walking distance to it and then you can kind of discover the whole street of St. George and like 10 minutes 10 15 minutes go through it if you're just walking through it. if you're just walking through it driving it's a different story you might take half an hour or so so one thing i would recommend is find an airbnb that's really close to st george or in the heart of it because that would be very helpful and it avoids uh, from paying parking too because it's really packed exactly uh and you save money on parking too so paying a little bit extra for airbnb is worth it in our opinion uh but right now we're gonna go to the castle and i'll show you guys when we get there <laughs> Sorry for the wind, guys. This is the, the view that we're looking at right now with the castle. I'm not sure how well we can hear me too with the, with the actual wind happening right now, but we're gonna head it that way to the castle. Let's go, Kay. Kay's freezing. She is cold. She's doing the dance. Let's go. So this is called Castillo de San Marcos. And this is what the castle should look like in its prime. But right now,
So I'm guessing this was the moat. Yeah, look. So this was the moat around the castle. See, the wind is not as well. <laughs> For now. It is kind of cool. It's a little moat to the castle. Frozen cake. <laughs> So guys, this is a soldier's life. This is how they used to live. They used to go on those beds and sleep there. Okay, this is where you would sleep. If you're a guard, this is where you would sleep. You have, you have your meal here, with a little window for air, some fire, and sleep on these stuff. Tough, tough blankets. Okay, do you think this in the warmth uh, or in the cold weather this will detect you? No, it won't be enough. Look at the clothes, yeah. And they're little, I guess, each person would keep their food, bowls there and stuff. Oh, it's warm in here. You can feel it. Yeah. It's like warmth coming through. Ooh. Order from what? I need more. Can we open it? No. So guys, this is where the prison would be. And it's pretty warm, so I'm guessing during the summer, if you're a prisoner, you would hate your life. Carso prison. Carso. Which means? Prison. 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 Yeah, I, I want to go in there because it's warm. <laughs> so this is inside the castle. So babe, this is where you would live. This would be your courtyard. This is where you get water from. I'm guessing this would be the storage or yeah, this is where the meat would go, huh? It's where all the alcohol would be. And veggies? All the stuff. This is where I would hang out. And then you have a, a guard protecting it. So this would be the, the quarters of Sir Frederick, and I, I'm guessing he'll be sleeping here. <coughs> oh, 
40 k fund. I'm guessing this is where the little chapel is. And you come sit down here like this. And maybe say your prayers. Or if this was not the chapel, this would be like a meeting hall. And the chapel was over there next to it. It's one or the other. I perceive this to be like a strategy meeting hall where the soldiers sit, but who knows? And guys, now we're going to the secret um, area. So this is the powder room. So there was a door to it from the outside, but I guess that's covered. Uh, but this is where they'll keep all the, I guess, the powder for the cannons, which some of the cannon cleaning tools were over there. And I'm guessing they keep it here because it's dry from the environment, uh, because you want to keep this dry as well for, and ready for battle. And it's kind of warm in here, right? It's more warm. And then, here, I don't know where it goes. You want to go explore? Go. Let's do it. Ah. So this is more of the powder room. I think I blew my knee. That's how old, how old I am. And there goes Kay. And this is where the rest of the powder will be. I guess they'll keep it like super, super secretly saved. This is kind of cool. And this is where all the stuff will decay. Yeah. Now give me a kiss in a Spanish fort. <laughs> Let's go. Again? Yep, after you, Kay. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah. <laughs> hey, just, just crawl under. Scare them. Just scare them. Let's go, boom. Guys, back in the day, you go poo poo here. This was kind of like the restroom area. And I guess, I guess this will go to the water once you use it. Yeah. Twice a day, you would get a natural cleansing. Wow. Right there. Oh, so when I guess when the water goes like the tide and stuff like that. Natural cleansing. Okay, we need to hurry up. I want to hear this.
I say goodbye to the castle. It's really, really, really windy and cold up there. Like, very cold. So we're we're gonna go warm up, maybe have one coffee. See? Or head up somewhere to the uh, to the apartment to warm up a little bit. Because I believe it's in the 40s and 50s and we didn't have our, yeah, we didn't have our nice jackets with us. We're not ready for this. So we're gonna take a quick, brisk walk to the new place. Uh, I think our San Agustin adventure is coming to an end. Um, we were supposed to show you some lights, but it was very cold. So I want to put some lights here for you guys at the end of this video. Uh, the reason is because we actually saw everything last night. We wanted like a little bit of a private moment. It was pretty cute. We just walked through it and it, it's maybe like a five minute walk. You see all the lights, it's very cute. There is a really cool restaurant. What was it called? Casa... Casa Reina. Casa Reina. That one is really good. We definitely recommend it to get on the rooftop uh, of the restaurant and just have some meal. The food is delicious. It's amazing. The place has been pretty cool. It's a very small place. The St. George Street has been small. You can pretty much walk through the whole street in 10 minutes. Uh, and it's been very chilly. Uh, we're both freezing <laughs> right now. We're recording this video. <laughs> yep. We're freezing. But uh, we did our best. Uh, we enjoyed our time. And I think this is going to be the closure of our video here with this beautiful view. We're going to spend some time on the Check wonderful on the bench. Lions, and there's a, a lion right somewhere. There. There. Where? <laughs> like all the way. You guys see the lion up there? Yep. Okay, point to it. Yep. There. <laughs> So the lion, the what? What do you call the? What was the lion? The name? The lion bridge. The lion bridge. I think that is the lion I bridge. Um, so it's pretty cool. There's a lot of traffic here. A lot of uh, people are coming to visit San Agustin as well. It's pretty packed. Like if you guys walk down St. George Street right now, it's it's, it's shoulder like the to Disney shoulder. Disney parks. Yeah. The busyness of it. It's the St. George Street is Disney of uh, San Agustin, I guess. But it's really cool that houses, the construction is, it's like an old, it has a little bit of a Spanish influence on it. It looks really nice. Uh, we enjoyed our time again. Uh, if you guys are new to the channel and enjoyed this video, please subscribe. And if you actually like the video, click the like button to help with the YouTube algorithm. And we'll catch you guys later. Ciao.